viewers, welcome to Home Cooking with me, Hema Subramanian. Now, today's recipe is very special because we've been getting a lot of requests for this particular recipe. And so I've decided to make it as soon as possible for all of you. It's none other than chicken biryani. So I'm sure all of you are smiling right now. So let's take a look at the ingredients. Rub the chicken pieces with turmeric powder, chilli powder and salt and let it sit for about 15 to 20 minutes. So you can see I have very good quality basmati rice. Uh, I've soaked this basmati rice in water for about half an hour. Then I've strained the water and just left it as is for another half an hour. This recipe is a pressure cooker chicken biryani. Please make a note of that. I'm sure there are different ways and different methods of preparing biryani. But this is a simple way that uh, I make at home and I'm going to show you how to do it today. Add ghee, three large tablespoons and uh, about one, two tablespoons oil. Add the whole spices, cinnamon, cloves, cardamom and bay leaf. Medium sized onions, five. Next, add the tomatoes, four medium to large tomatoes, finely chopped. Next, add the, the masala paste. Next, add the chicken pieces. So I've used about one and a half kilos of chicken for one kilo of rice. Uh, it gives more flavor to the biryani, if there's more meat in it. So that is why, but if you don't want that extra half kg, you can cut it down to one kilo of chicken to one kilo of rice. One bunch coriander and one bunch mint leaves. These are all essential to give you that great flavor for your chicken biryani. Now season it with a little salt. This is a 500 ml glass that I have here or a measuring cup that I have here. I'm going to use the two cups of diluted coconut milk. Check for seasoning and add enough salt as required. The so first step is to pressure cook the chicken without the rice. So now cook the chicken for about 5 whistles. And now the final step is to add the rice. Gently mix it in. So I've closed the lid and kept the flame on medium low. So wait till the steam comes and then place the weight. After that, cook for about 10 minutes. There you have this absolutely delicious chicken biryani. And I can't wait to dig into this plate right now. Do subscribe to your YouTube channel and also follow us on Facebook.